Greetings, everyone. Vitavis back once again for what should be the last episode of this first episode of The Walking Dead. It's odd that I'm making my things episodes and I'm actually playing episodes. It's very strange. But anyway, to open this up, we just use the axe. This is why you had to go to the motor inn first, because you have to do this. Awesome. This is part of the puzzle. Now to distract those things carefully. Okay, so now... I can't reach that brick. All we gotta do is open the gate. Let's get in there. Okay, let's do it. This is pretty That's simple. the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. You can use the axe on it, but it doesn't do anything. <clears throat> and if you do it twice, he gives up and says keys it is then. We're just gonna go ahead and use the keys. Oh no. Oh, shit. We gotta hurry.
I think this whole thing is to show that, like, lots of walkers are gonna be coming to them because she's from really far away and she can hear the bell. Time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round right back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly-dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Guys, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Hey, Lee! If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this! Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know... <laughs> I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit! Are you sure? Shit! Oh, shit! Okay, then. Come in time. Can you look for something to stick in between the hands? Something real strong, okay? Okay. the end of episode one. Well, not quite. But it's pretty much over. Stage 9 catastrophe. 
I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. If they go from upstairs. Are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. I wonder if that could change if you make a different decision and don't tell Carly to give her the gun, but I don't know. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true, but after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. I don't think there's any way to, to have them both make it. Super Dinosaur was toast! But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then... Hey, Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. <sighs> Let me go deal with this. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Not really. Good. Stay away from her. Or everyone here knows that Lee Everett is a killer. And I'm not talking about those things out there. You hear me? I asked you a question, boy. 
Then again, I wouldn't expect a convicted murderer to listen to anything anybody's got to say. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Or not. <laughs> would be fun if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. is episode two and it lets you know how you did compared to other people that play the game and then the credits so i do hope you guys enjoyed episode one of let's play um the walking dead it's not technically episode one it's like episode six or something but they are called episodes so and as you can tell they do it in episode format like they showed you little teasers of what's going to happen in the next episode and i just have to tell you like the next episode is going if you guys haven't seen the next episode by somebody else playing it then you will be taken by surprise trust me for the rest because they're all the same except for the very last episode there's a song at the credits so I'm just gonna leave these ones in here so you guys do know who made the game give proper credit where credit is due but all the rest of the credits for all the episodes are all the same except like I said the last one because there is a song there so I'll, I'll put that one in there too Anyway, this, guy, this uh, video is going to run a little bit longer because uh, you probably actually heard my timer go off. I was trying to make sure that the timer wouldn't go off, but this time I just I wasn't paying attention. I kind of get sucked into the game when the story uh, 
comes around like that. But anyway, that is the end of episode one of The Walking Dead. Join me when we take on episode two. Uh, it was like starved for hunger or something like that. I don't know. Let me see. Let's see it real quick. Oh, starved for help. That's what the episode two is. So anyway, guys, my name is Vitavis Prime. Thank you very much for watching this episode of The Walking Dead. Join me next time where we are going to tackle episode 2 of this game. If you did like the video, please leave it a like. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Take it easy, and I will see you then. Bye.